Hey guys, Bigfoot here. Today, we're going to take a step back in time and uh, recreate a primitive skill that's been lost. I have Now, I've looked all over the internet. Um, I've searched several places, even the local library, and I can't find anything on this primitive skill. And this primitive skill is called a Chinookan fire plane. And uh, it was requested of me by Mark Petrowski. And uh, I'm fortunate enough to have seen this done and have done it myself when I was about I think 10 or 11 years old and uh, so what what it consists of is one steak in this case I'm using mullein nice and dry this steak gets driven into the ground and then in the bottom will be surrounded by my tinder bundle and then it's got two other little sticks and these are both mullein also and these two sticks create the friction work up and down up and down up and down like that and I'll be using two hands and uh, to go make the friction. And then your dust falls down onto your tinder bundle and eventually creates a coal. So we're gonna try it out. There's gonna be a, a, probably quite a bit of failures. I'm sure it's gonna take some time. It's a bit windy out here, so that's gonna have a little bit of a, a factor in it. But um, we're gonna do it anyways. And sorry, Mark, that this has taken so long, but here we go. All right. We'll catch you over at the fire. I learned how to do this a long time ago um, on the reservation when they were doing uh, primitive living skills, uh, ancestral skills uh, class. And that was, well, like 25 years ago or more. So we're going to try this. It's called a Chinook and Fire Plane. And I got a, a piece of mullein here and two more pieces of mullein here. And there's two ways to do a Chinook and fire plane, but I'm gonna try this one first. So what you do is you, you take your two pieces, you grip them, I got my tinder bundle, big tinder bundle down here. So let's, let's try it. A little friction fire is sounding pretty good right now. Uh, but we're getting a little bit of dust down in there. So I can see some smoke coming up. A little tiny bit of smoke coming up there. Holy moly. Oh, man. Holy. Whew. That's tough. I don't know if we got anything or not. Oh, I do see a little hole down here. More concentrated. Okay. Holy moly. Woo! So, okay, let's try this again. <clears throat> Holy crap.
Well, this is my take 17. So I had a coal. I lost it, so I added a little bit more tinder in here and um, added a few pieces of cedar bark around the bottom to maybe help catch that coal a little better. So let's see. It's a little windy, so it's not ideal. smoke before just can't seem to blow it into a flame uh, just, we're gonna really try to get as much as we can here uh, this time I'm gonna try to remove the stake out of the middle instead of taking the tinder bundle off of the stake uh, okay uh, uh, oh that's hot if the spark's a little dry, I mean a little wet. think we'd get it going oh my goodness well there it is after about three hours we have a fire using chinook and fire plane oh my goodness we're out i don't know if i'll be doing that again i'm i'm, I'm going to try the other um the other chinook and fire plane method and see if it maybe it'll be a little bit easier than this one but this one I think we were using grass maybe and I think maybe this cedar bark that I have might have just a little bit more moisture in it than I thought but there it is got to keep these skills alive and uh, keep passing them down to future generations all right well I'm gonna put this fire out and then I'm done for the day all right guys we'll catch you next time this is Bigfoot out